Kaiju Ice again. Today I'm here to do another anime review. And this anime review is to Yamanoku Kun. No, ah, sorry. Yamanoku Kun to Seven Ni No O Mochi. Yep. Now, this episode is episode four, guys. Yep, episode four. Now, in this episode, it starts off with a. We found out that Yamada and the started Supernatural are going to a school trip. In this school trip, Yamada and uh, Oriha, I think how you say her name. I'm like I'm not. I'm bad at names. Bad at names. Bad at names, guys. Um, Cersei. Ah, Cersei. I'll go call her Cersei. Uh, the main female character. Um, they switch bodies. Found out Cersei gets travel sick and yeah. Stuff goes on and one point when she um was studying in Yamada's um um room for the hot for the hol for the um for the school trip because this technically as she was as she switched bodies with him, makes logical sense she will be in his room and and she will he will be in her room and stuff like that. Um in this um she had to go and get in Yamada's body, she needed to get some stuff from her bag. So she had to go into the girls' room in Yamada's body. But knowing the uh, student council vice president, who's called Oriha, I think, Oriha has her name, trying to. took a picture of her. And Fred is Yamada! That if she does if she, if she doesn't. If she doesn't. Um, if he doesn't, sorry, if he doesn't, if Yamada doesn't make, um, make Shari, serious ah, Shari, uh, Sirisa to not take the test, she will spread the picture around the school. And one of them was showing Shirashi and Yamada's body looking at her panties. But, logical sense, as she was a girl, she didn't think it was bad, but yeah, she was in Yamada's body, who was a guy. So that was a big deal. That's the big problem. As technically people thought he, she was Yamada. Big problems would pull up in that scene. Pervert or something like that, which Yamada didn't want. So you might think. First off, you might think, oh, he's going to try to stop um, Shiro taking the test. No, that's not his. If first, he actually decides to switch bodies with Yoha, but it ends up failing. It seems like, and then he sort of lost that capability of switching bodies afterwards. Kiss after kissing so, sorry, uh, Yuha. After kissing Yura, he lost that ability, and new ability, and he actually gained a new ability. And that ability was the ability to make someone fall in love with you if you kiss that person. So anybody that you kiss, they end up falling in love, to, in, fall in love on you, for you. They fall in love with you. And if that's the capability. After kissing Yoha, Yo that means Yoha has a special ability as well. Now, there's only two options I can think of that Yoha, ha after she kissed someone, that she can change their ability, or that with Yamada's ability to switch bodies, might not actually be a body switching ability, but ability to switch stuff. Not to switch exactly bodies. But able to switch something that is directly on a human body. So if you have the capability on using a ability, the abilities will switch. Maybe that's the situation. Maybe after Yama kissed or her, he actually switched her ability to uh, anybody she kissed to make fall in love. Uh, but her, his ability switched it, and now he has that ability. So that could be. So those are my two options. That what Yoha, what happened with Yoha. So, in this, and with, it doesn't resolve, it, it, I think it's going to resolve next episode, but he's trying to keep it a secret, after going back to after school, he is keeping it a secret from Usha, because they all think that Usha will only stay in the club because she wants to switch bodies with, yep, with Yamada, as she has lost ability, you think she's going to not come because Yamada doesn't have the ability, which I don't think is true, I think she now, I think, Shiri he likes Yamada now in a way. Um, I don't know if she fell in love with her yet, him yet. 
from the way it looked so far, from the personality, but again, possibility in my did. But, again, it's a capability. As he, uh, now that means Yamada's new ability right now is any person he kisses, he will make him fall in love with them, and if he kisses the person he already kissed to make them fall in love, he can, he can reverse the effects now to make them back to normal. So, if he kisses someone, he can re-kiss them to make them go back to normal. Like the way he switches bodies. Um, but, in this situation, if, if I'm right that, my, my first theory is right that, his, his, kiss, his switching body ability is not just to switch. His switching ability, kissing ability, is not just to switch bodies, but also also able to switch powers. Makes logical sense. It makes logical sense that's possible. But that means if that as which I did kiss Yamada, that means out the abilities. It seems like the body switching ability is more the switching ability is more superior than the uh, ability to make. Uh, so that guys, something came up. But uh, anyway, my back. I'm back, guys. Okay, now I'll say back previously. Oh yeah, as he had the capability of, as they switched, as they switched. Um, seems like if they switch, seems like after, like I said, it seems that the body sw the switching ability is more superior than the kissing, making someone fall in love with you ability. So it's a possibility that you know, just switched abilities, not bodies this time. So that means there are certain people he can't switch bodies with, but he can switch instead of switching bodies, he can switch abilities. But if he is able to control this ability, he can choose that either switch ability or switch bodies with those kind of people. But anyway, most of this, this episode is about um he just got right it just Yama just going through the situation the situation of him losing his ability and having this new ability. Which and I think it's going to be happening in the next week's episode, where it's the conclusion to this little arc, to make sure they get he gains his ability back um, from Yuha, Yuha. So, yeah, mostly this is what the episode's about. Now, the animation quality in this is good. It's good. Still good. Very good. Still very good. A good, a very good animation um, again. I don't. I think. I, I don't think I see any. I think there was a little bit of problem with the animation this time, but. Again, and it was still very good. Not really much notice. I didn't really notice anything that wrong. I'm, I think I did, but again, I might not. So, but anyway, oh, sorry, guys. But anyway, um, the animation was really good, and the cat, and just the way people were acting, and I really just like, and also a bit of fan service in this episode this time. Um, you really see in this anime, you hardly see much fan service, but again, there is a bit of fan service, but not much, guys. Um, yeah. I mean, so, because when Yamada thought about him kissing Yushirihi to make it she falls in love with him, he wants how he, she would act if she falls in love with that kind of, when he uses that ability. So that's when the fan service still came out in his dream and mind state, which I have to admit, all boys think that if that situ if that happens to them, like new boys can't, none of you boys can deny it. Once you think about someone you like, as or thinking about turning someone you into fall in love with you or something, the first thing that coming one of the first things that are coming to your mind are dirty thoughts. You admit that I'm I'm like that. I mean I'm I'm admitting it. When I think about guys, when I think about girls and, and fall in love with me, some of the I do end up thinking about dirty thoughts, which, of course, this this the main our main character does just show the boy's mind and yeah, but anyway and yeah, I think that's mostly what this episode's about. Just figuring out um and about how he's gonna switch out draw is is how he, how he's gonna get his ability back from Yuha and yeah. And yeah, so yeah, I hope you guys like it. Become hope you guys like this anime review. Become one channel fans today. If you guys want to send me fan mail, give my description below. My address is there. And yeah, hope you guys like it. Comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.